gentlemen, welcome to Connect 360 Presents, The Bearded Kings. I am King Bear in the building. Comedian C.J. Charles. Big sleep from the West Coast. And for the first time, ladies and gentlemen, we have with us today a special guest. Comedian, actor, writer, Marine, all that good stuff. The writer of the book. Oh, oh my God. God. And make him warm point. The letter is too small. The letter is too small. It's right My there. eyes are too close together, man. I can't be reading to say it. for the Miss America. Go oh, ahead. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, uh, for the first time, <laughs> special guest. <laughs> Big Dottie, Dottie in the building. What's going on, What's going on brother? Oh, I can't call it. It could always be worse. Life is good, man. All right. So you guys ready to get going? Sir. All right. Yes, well, sir, let's get it, dude. Let's do it. <laughs> Topic for today, gentlemen of the blue table, how much disrespect would you take from an in-law living with you? Say you and your, your wife, significant other, been married for years, and then all of a sudden, after five, 10 years of y'all being married, your mother-in-law has to move in with you. All right, so it's not it's not like she's been lived in, living with you. She moved in with you. After she moves in, she starts with the disrespect. It could be verbal, physical, mental, or emotional. Physical? Yeah. <laughs> we gonna work our way. We gonna work our way. Mom, beat your ass. <laughs> like, you, you just stand in the kitchen and mom coming out. My frying pan? Show, show ass hey. out the refrigerator. Like, hey, in your house. That, all that stops when you punch in the dick. Aha! <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> oh my Just God. Just saying. <laughs> so we're going to start with verbal. All right. So um, your mother in law moves in and she starts uh, being verbally disrespectful to you. She's talking about whether you don't make enough money or you ain't shit. You don't do this. You don't do that. You don't take care of her daughter the way that she thinks you should. You know, all the regular rigmarole. Her father was so much better than you, all this, all that type of stuff. Mm. How much of that do you take? I think and, I then, think and then, when you get to the level of taking, what's your next action? I think I've answered this somewhat similar before. So, the first time, I'm going to talk to my significant other, whoever it is, and say, hey, you need to check your moms real quick. Mm -hmm. it's, it's just, I'm out of respect to you. Mm -hmm. This is going to escalate. If it does not happen the way I think it's going to happen, then I'll take it from there. I'm definitely going to go chew that ass up. See, I, I'm, I'm in the opposite one, man. So for me, that conversation is taking place before they move in with me. Because I'm already, because I'm already the one, I'm already the person in this house. So that conversation happens when we're saying, hey, look, such and such is coming to stay with us. And I'll be like, cool, these are the ground rules. And, and this is what I'm not going to allow. Mm -hmm. Because to, cause that brief should have taken place before they move in. That right. way, when they do it, they already know they've already done. Like, hey, look, these are the things that you will not do. And this will get you kicked out. Okay. So for me, That's we fair. you won't even we won't even get to that point in my house because the moment I'm disrespecting in my house, where I pay the mortgage, no, we got an issue. <laughs> I'm glad you said that, brother, because <laughs> now we gonna go to the emotional side of the track. Damn, sleeping against your hands, you already ready to dirty it up. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, we're no, here. You're ready. I'll, I'll, I'll wait. No, no, you're on the side of the track. <laughs> Go ahead, Sleep. Hey, Go ahead, Sleep. I kind of want to see call. where this, I want to see. I want to see where it goes now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's gonna go. But go ahead, Sleep. What, what do you think? Um, I uh, that's that's a tough one. Cause I'm, I'm I've never I've never been in that situation, so I'm just trying of to course. imagine what with the with the with my with my in laws 
or with somebody that's in my you know immediate family if we were to let them move in and then the disrespect started after they moved in right so my thing is like i don't i don't care how you feel i don't care how you see me i don't care what you do as long as the respect level is maintained mm -hmm. once the line is crossed then there's there's no whole bar there's no whole bar like i'm not i'm not a big like talker so somebody somebody got to feel it so let's just say for for shits and giggles my my in-laws moved in mm -hmm. you know rest rest in peace to my my my, my 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 wife's mom but let's just say they moved in and her mom like started going crazy telling me that everything that, it, that i'm not doing mm -hmm. that her dad got a feeling him 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 no because i don't feel like he'll ever get the best of me yeah. but he got, <laughs> i can take him easy <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, he he he's gonna have to he's gonna have to have an example made out of him. But like, okay, every every time you go crazy on me, oh, that, go ahead, and sleep. Every 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 for 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 whatever reason, um, like like I said, he's he's just gonna, he's just gonna have to feel it. I'm gonna have to make an example out of him. So every time you decide to go crazy on me, I'm gonna go crazy on him. And she outside move out. <laughs> okay. So. Sorry about that, fellas. All right, so now, like what you guys are saying, what happens with the the in law is elderly or or not there all the way, and now your wife is defending their actions. On some senile shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, then I like, go ham, and she won't huh? run none of that shit. <laughs> like, okay. not, not that type. I'm, I'm not talking hey. complete, you know, Alzheimer's. I'm talking about just, you know, she, her conditions make her more uh, aggravated and more. Being short of Tourette's is gonna get your ass cussed out. Okay, but mm -hmm. you know, no, 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 no. So for me, we'll know that before that discussion takes place. That's why they have homes. Yeah. Okay. Because if and they are mentally unstable, <laughs> if they are mentally unstable already, why am I bringing that drama into my home already? Because now it's affecting more than just the individual. It's affecting my wife, my kids, me. You know what I'm saying? So right. I'm like, look, we better start doing research and be like, look, there's got to be a place where this person can go. We'll go visit every week. We'll have a picnic on Wednesday. I don't give a shit. <laughs> but I'm not bringing you in my home to add to that. You know what I'm okay. saying? Okay. And then your wife hits you with that infamous, well, I feel like she's my mother and she took care of me. And I feel that the best place for my mother is me taking care of her. I don't think anybody else can. So I feel she <laughs> needs to be here. And that's what <laughs> I feel should happen. And there's no way you could put my mother anywhere else except with me. Shit. This bitch, please. I got <laughs> Shut <I'm scared>. it. <laughs> I, I ain't even had to think about that. <laughs> what I say the we best case scenario, worst case scenario is like, hey, we have to do it, man. We'll have a tiny home in the backyard. Well, you can be removed from not everything. A tiny, not a shed. You gotta put hey, my mama in a shed. shed. <laughs> yeah. Hey, see, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a little more, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little more psychological with it. Let's let's just say that all those mental illnesses played a played a part, and and moms was wilding the way you say moms was wilding. You you got to get in mom's pocket to make her start diverting that anger towards her daughter. How you do that? You got you got a gaslight. I think hey, that's, that's what the kids it. call it. You got a gaslight. So that gaslight. same anger, you 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 get in mom's pocket. You wash the dishes, or you do you do all the things that mom wants you to do, mm -hmm. just just to get in her pocket, so she can start diverting that anger. So so you and moms can sit back and talk about what her daughter ain't doing. <laughs> then her senile ass will start diverting that energy towards her daughter. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> I can be in the corner like, see, I told see, you. I, I'm, 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 I'm like, no, no, don't, don't get mad at my mama. She's right. like, wait a minute, that's not, that's not even your mama. She is now. Right. She loved me more than she loved you. Right, mama, okay. tell her what we were talking about earlier because she don't mm -hmm. listen to me. Okay, mm -hmm. okay, so that uh, could fix the problem. I like that. Or, 
Or it's too much work. <laughs> or it could be mama could turn around and then stop talking about you to your face and now talking about you buying your back to your do- to the daughter and now the daughter's coming back and relaying stuff to you that mom is talking about. That's cool. Mama's because calling when, because when, that's cool because when everybody's in the room, that's married knows that probably happened at some exactly. point. Exactly. Exactly. Anyway, so so that's not going to be anything new. I expect that to happen. I expect if there's an issue, they go wipe them wipe talk to me. That's just the way it is. So I'm not worried. You can be in my house all day and be talking about me every single day that you there. But the moment it becomes blatantly disrespectful, now we have a different issue. Okay. You can talk shit. You can talk shit quietly. That's on you. <laughs> okay. So and that brings up to the, the back to the question. At what what level do you do something about it and what do you do when it gets to that disrespectful level? You seen the Fresh Prince of Bel Air, right? Oh God! You remember how? <laughs> Not so. you, you, you said the mama flying dog. Not DJ. Real, real turn off. She gotta go. She gotta go. Come on, man. come on. Wifey is not gonna allow you to send mama flying out the front. Door. She don't gotta be in the same room. She, she don't know won't hurt her. Only mama. I'll be like, go ahead, go to Costco. <laughs> I got some stuff I need to handle. Wow, I'm looking at, let's see here on my screen. I see half and half and another half. Boy, I see people giving up half they shit like real quick. Y'all know what's going to happen when you do that shit. Right? Yeah, that, that's cool. You can't take half of nothing. I ain't got shit to give you. <laughs> that doesn't mean we both be broke. That's all. Right. All right. <laughs> Like, that, that ain't real brick. That ain't real brick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know these judges have a fine way of just manufacturing half out of nothing. <laughs> Y'all know how that works. Yeah, yeah. All right. Hey, hey, I live in the barracks. It don't take a lot to live. All you got to do is be able to survive. <laughs> okay. All right. So verbal as long as it's quiet. Now, what if it's what if it's physical? What if the mama is 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 doing things, you know, she's 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 not doing enough to hurt you, obviously. I mean, we're all big, strong, able men and all that good stuff. But what if she's putting her hands on you and then she's blaming sickness or illness when she's doing it? You putting your hands Bro, back you on her mama? Hey, hey, look, look, look. So when I smack hey, the sins back you, you in the ass, hey, I'll blame hey, the sickness back to me. This bitch is reflex. No, I don't know what he's hey, talking about. No, you can buy it. You can buy straight jackets off Amazon. Nah, no. Nah. I ain't even gotta go that far. I ain't gotta go that far. Soon as she blames soon as she blames sickness and illness, so do I. Exactly. She is an enemy combatant. <laughs> <laughs> she better be prepared to defend herself. <laughs> Right. She better have a good defense. <laughs> I, can see the class. <laughs> like, I was triggered. Oh my God! Hey, y'all going to jail? Don't you your dick, Your Honor? <laughs> hey, right here, in my medical record. It says, "Bitches better not fuck with me." <laughs> <laughs> it says it right here. <laughs> so, so wait a minute. So with with the mama and the daughter corroborating the story, saying that you started it. What are you going to do at that point? Hey, they just go spend the night in jail. So, yeah, hey. that's absolutely. But at that point, the the, the line's been drawn in the exactly. sand. You know when I get back in this bitch, you better keep your mouth closed. <laughs> you better keep your mouth closed. No, no, no. If I go to jail, no. If I go to jail, it ain't no when I get back. It's when I get back. You ain't there. Like you bet. Don't even be <laughs> hey. earshot of me. Like hey. don't, you. Matter of fact, don't even be on my property. Get out the tiny house. <laughs> you kicking moms out the tiny house? Hey. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing to wifey though? Is she going to? I'll right, because you got wifey to deal with on it too. Hey, hey! At the end of the day, somebody got to make a logical decision to say, okay, where am I going to be? Like, hey, we got a little bit of life left. I can be on the streets with someone that's crazy, or I can be here. I'll be like, choose wisely, because once the decision is made, we ain't going back. Yeah, hey. but now it's up to you. What decision are you making? Refer to oh, my medical. I just refer, said that. refer to my medical record. I come home, <laughs> they will be gone. No, and if they, and if, if they not, 
I will burn my own house down just out of spite. <laughs> I will set my own shit on fire. <laughs> Bro, there's a level of disrespect that you, you just don't take. Like, it's the same thing, but it's the same thing. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm torturing like like my Angela shit. Bassett. I'm, 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 I'm torturing to my shit in hopes that they in it. I'm taking everybody. Everybody got to go. If I go to jail, all y'all niggas gonna pay. <laughs> Hey, 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 there will be signs. You'll be like, why are you taking your TV out the house? <laughs> I'm, ca- I'm carrying all my shit out the door. This be Jordans and TVs. No, this wasn't premeditated at all. I really need to move this shit to the storage. Yeah, no. He's serious. He had his Xbox in his pocket. <laughs> that nigga said he got his Jordans and his TVs. <laughs> Fuck that. Do it like a superhero, blow that bitch up and walk away in slow mo with it blowing up behind me while the house is blowing up. It's like the reality is it's the same thing. Like if 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 my if my mom's and pops come in and they disrespecting my wife, I'm like, look, hey. love y'all, but y'all gotta go. Y'all gotta go. I like I'm not hey, cause at the end of the day, hey, regardless of what you feel, like, hey, we, this shit's already established. Hey. You're the outlying factor. I don't care if you raised me. I don't care about none of that. Hey, there's a level. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to keep it not personal. I know your mama. Your mama disrespect your wife in a heartbeat. <laughs> no, she won't. No, she won't. Hey, she um, knows. Hey. You do know her. You do know her. <laughs> But she know when she come to my house. Trust me, hey. a few times. She know. Your mom. There's a level. Wow. <laughs> Oh yeah, I love her though. She she zero she, she, chill dog. Watch, watch the baby when she was a baby. My mom was zero chill, but they, you know, <laughs> but that's the thing. That's a conversation that I had to have with my mom because I yeah. know my mom. My mom is a lot. Yeah, <laughs> but <laughs> she is. Sleep I'm just agreeing that. with you. I'm not laughing. I'm yeah, agreeing with you. Yeah, yeah. He knows. <laughs> he knows. But when my mom comes out to visit, because she didn't, she visited us in Okinawa for like months, it's like, hey, look, these are your left and right lateral limits. There's a level of respect here, and you either gonna respect that, or you had to go somewhere else. <laughs> hey, there, there's somebody else that looks just like me on this island somewhere. You can go hang with him. <laughs> 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 For real. For real. For those who don't know, Donnie is a twin. <laughs> nice. We just put that out there. <laughs> okay. All right, so it sounds like y'all got it pretty much sewed up. So the big bad boys in the room are basically saying if if the moms disrespect, they're gonna put her out. Mm-mm. I didn't say I was gonna put her out. I'll oh. burn the house down with her in. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, officer, that skeleton you found. Trust me, I already know who it belongs. I already know. To. No on. need, no no need, no need to, to do DNA. I can tell you exactly who it is. <laughs> I can tell you exactly who it is. Here's a picture of us yesterday. <laughs> you know you just burnt down a house? Yes, I do. Refer to my medical. And it's record. like it's like anybody. It's mom, dad, cousin, whoever. Like at that point, like, no, nah, you stepping into our domain that we created. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. You better stay in your lane. So you even better, if the even, even if your wife, phone. so even if your wife is like, yeah, you forget it. This is a domain that we created, and I feel like she should be here. And if you need to go, then you need to go. I've been waiting for this. Here we go. <laughs> uh, hey, I'll, 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 I'll make this real simple. That's why I'm on wife number two. Because <laughs> there's, there's levels, right? I'm against the one, but it's like, hey, you learn. There's, a, there's things you learn in the first one is like I'm not gonna deal with this shit in the second one. Um, yeah, so me and my wife have a we have what we call a, a kukumu, a clear, complete, mutual understanding. What? 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 What did I hear you say? Of what's expected in our marriage? These, these niggas got acronyms in their marriage. Hell That's yeah, these shit. niggas is next <laughs> level, bro. Hey, hey, hey. That's a, hey they that got like trees. That sounds like some hey. shit the therapist tell you. Hey, right. uh, I'm gonna need you guys to respect the cuckoo move. <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, what? You, gonna, you gonna go ahead and be like, "Damn, yeah, babe, hey, we need to work on a cuckoo move." It's a, hey, I need to go to the Lions Center, the Geneva Convention, and <laughs> go over the treaty. 
And no, for those who don't know, my, my brother Donnie got a short temper. So when I come down there and visit, and he get to losing this shit, I'm like, nah, nigga, respect the cuckoo move. Yeah, boy. First of all, I don't like that you said I got a temper. That that's what got you bothered? Not the whole cuckoo thing. I don't know. If I'm mad as shit, and then my boy come in like, eh, eh, eh. Cuckoo, That's what I be mad. I know the safe word. Cuckoo. Hey, hey, for, for, for those again, Do, Donnie is a twin, but Donnie was also the twin that everybody he may know this or he may not, but everybody referred to Donnie as the mean one. Nobody liked fucking with Donnie because he was the mean one. Donnie spoke his mind and he talked shit all the time. Ain't nothing changed. It's the same. <laughs> Cuckoo, but that don't mean nothing. <laughs> <Cuckoo. laughs> Hey, 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 in my defense, that was the active duty Marine down there. I, I am the nicest person that I know. You, you've always thought that. <laughs> and forever on this show, you will be. Because the second you start wilding out, nigga, I'm about to create a kookaboo button. <laughs> Every time you come on the show, I'm going to be like, kookaboo. Kookaboo. <laughs> Like, hey. left, right, left, like, hey, hey. where we at? That's funny. That is dope, man. There's some some shit you should just leave in the house. You, hey, there, there's certain there's certain things that will be used against you. In the hey, man, nah, let it out. Hey, <laughs> safe oh, space. I, oh, I stand oh by that's why we didn't say day. safe space. So <laughs> oh, it's all I free. stand by that all day, every day. <laughs> there is a there is a understanding you have to have. Especially in America, like that's just the reality of it. Because you'll have people from the outside that don't agree with how your marriage is. People from the outside, you see, yeah. see, that's where you messed you up. Like, so the fuck what? Like, that's that, that, that's where that's where you messed up. You got to isolate and cut off the outside. Oh, you yeah, make them think right. that it's just bro. you make you make them think that it's just you. That's it. Bro, no. That's it. Bro, you I, and me hey, against I, the hey. world. That's it. Hey, hey, no, I, 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 hey I'm I'm, to- I'm toxic as fuck. You can't have. <laughs> no, you don't. You don't need no friends. It's just me. I'm your best friend. <laughs> Mel, Mel, is, Mel is Blair Underwood from Tyler Perry movies. <laughs> yeah. 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 Who's one of them? <laughs> See, you can pull that shit married to a Mexican woman, man. You, that shit a little bit harder with these African Mexicans. <laughs> these hey. happens on some different shit out here, dog. dog I said, hey, I'm, I, I've been married long enough to know that, hey, dog. You got to cut some people off. Hey, oh, absolutely. A lot of I, them. I tell everybody, hey, dog, I have mental funerals daily. This is be dead to me instantly. I know that's right. Mental funerals, I like that. But he's the hey, but he's the nice one. <laughs> <laughs> But he's a nice one. Cuckoo. Cuckoo, nigga. Hey, you got like that. Hey, nice. When you say you got to put that extra RuPaul on that shit, too. You got to be like, Cuckoo. <laughs> for me, um, let me see. Uh, Well, for everybody who knows, you know, I got a big ass mouth. And. You know, the wife knows I I don't hold my tongue well at all. I'm I'm just like my grandmother in that regard. Um, you know, I like to say that uh, when God was putting in filters in everybody, He put my filter in backwards. So bullshit doesn't go in, but bullshit always comes out. So <laughs> I speak what's going on right there on the spot. So if her mom's wilding, I'm a wild right back, and. At the level you give it to me, I'm giving it right back. So if she's there, her mama's there, her great grandmama's there, you know, if Jesus is sitting on the couch, I don't give a shit. Everybody's gonna hear it and everybody's gonna get it. Um, if she hits you, huh? If she hits you, oh, I'm gonna throw something at her. Damn. I'm gonna go in the garage. First, of all, hold up. How how old is the grandma? Is she in the wheelchair? Nah, she's she's mom's age. Well, her her mom is like mom's age. Mm. Like 60s So You know And of course You know We're, we're speaking Complete hypotheticals Cause You know Her moms loves me And I love her moms But If she was one of those That didn't 
if her mom's put her hands on me, of course, I got to be a little bit more thinking about it because I'm not going to jail for hitting this bitch because she old and she... <laughs> And I know that. Oh, so wait up, wait up. Wait up. I'm gonna wait go up. to the garage. <laughs> and I'm the wife's mom. So. <laughs> <laughs> and Devin hey, hey, with the RB. Hey, 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 he was not lying about that backwards filter. Hey, 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 Bitch. <laughs> she's, she's, she's not hey, right. sleep. It's the type of shit that made too short happen. <laughs> too short gave me like, oh my god, this nigga just too too short gave you a standing ovation just now. He was like, sure. <laughs> Hey, she's not right there, 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 sir. She, <laughs> she, y'all are some assholes, man. She's not, she's not that on the normal, but in the connotation that she hit me, now she's dead. Okay, so that's what we're going with. So she put her hands on me. Now, now I got to hit this bitch back. So, <laughs> well, so I'm going to go to the garage and get my, my uh, limited edition Dexter uh, black rubber gloves. Put them on, you know, make sure that I alcohol wipe all fingerprints and everything off. Then I'm going to grab something and I'm going to go back in the house. I'm going to throw it and hit it in the damn head with it. Then, of That's course, I'm going to take the... Huh? That's too much effort. <laughs> That's a lot of effort. That's oh. a lot of effort. You got to think about it. You're like, let me go find it. You got to clean up. Oh, oh, oh. oh man. Yeah, Donnie, I when forgot to tell you. Alcohol. Not only am I King Bear, the Bear King, <laughs> but I'm also the president and active member of the Take It Too Far Brother Association. So that's what I do. <laughs> I take things way too motherfucking far. <laughs> that's that's my pleasure in life. <laughs> so I got to make sure that whatever I hit it with, when the case does go down, and they if they do decide to dust for prints, they're gonna be like, "Wow, this thing's been in your house all these years, and you have never touched it." I'd be like, "Yeah, I don't know whose that was. I ain't hit him. I don't know what you're talking about." <laughs> Plausible deniability. <laughs> I don't know how that bitch got hit with that motherfucking claw hammer. Oh, you're, what happened? <laughs> you're, you're also you're also the person with the most electronics in the house. I was just about to say that so, got cameras. I come in there and be like, "Hey, Alexa, right, play, 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 play back the last thirty minutes. Alexa, play the assault." <laughs> Yeah, but that's a way big. After I got audio. hit on my way to the garage, I'd be like, Alexa, good night. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, it's six shut down early. everything. <laughs> <laughs> everything goes mute and dead. We are radio darkness. We are now that's in crazy. the glass jar. <laughs> that's oh man. So yeah, we you know, respect has to be established and it has to be maintained. I'm one about rules, <clears throat> and it got to be. I don't go around disrespecting people, and you're not going to do it to me. It, it's it's just not. And I love my wife. I love her family. You know, but if shit goes down, I'll put all them niggas out. I'm <laughs> put all of them, all of them, all of them, all of them. Yeah, all of them, and not the legal way too. They're gonna just come home, and all they shit gonna be out in the grass. And like, I don't know, Your Honor. They, I came home myself and all that shit was outside. I don't even know what happened. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what happened. They, they wanted to get out on their own. I don't know what the hell happened. Yeah, y'all, better than me. Better than me. This yep. is going to be an empty, empty spot where the house used to sit. <laughs> See, I ain't fucking with you. I love my house. I, my I, I love my shit too. But I also love to be right. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, I'm sleeping. Oh, man. Uh, excuse me. All right. So we got everybody? Yep. Uh-oh. Yep, yep. All right. Actually, so eat. let's see. We got verbal. We got physical. Uh, mental and emotional. I guess they all kind of wrap up. Um. Okay, so we got one more question on it. Ladies and gentlemen, 
<laughs> We're going to transition to a new segment <laughs> that the fellas don't know about. What? Yes. <laughs> this is hey. a new. What's up? I, I think that was I was comedian CJ Trial's first high pitch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? We didn't even get into it yet. He already hit it. All right. So, gentlemen of the blue table. This new segment is going to be called How Much Would It Take? Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> and Donnie, Donnie's, Donnie's around to play it for the first time. Okay, so the rules to this new segment. All right? Here's the rules. Everybody pay attention. All right? <clears throat> Rule one. Everyone plays except the question giver. Oh, all right? So, <laughs> Wait, that's a shock. <laughs> We never heard that rule before. But that means, you know, later if you want to make up some questions, then you can make up questions and then you don't have to answer. Okay? That's simple. Two, you must complete the task no matter what. Three, you pick a dollar amount from one to one million and the amount rounds up. All right? It, it'll make sense later. I just got to put these rules out there. Four. If you pick one million, you go through a torment and you lose a finger. The torments change each time that we play a new game. Okay, so there's gonna be five questions, you got five fingers. All right, pretty easy so far. The winner is determined by who has the most fingers left at the end of the game. There can be multiple winners. All right, you guys ready? So, so only, you, you only you only lose a finger if you pick a million, right? And it, anything that would round up to a million, right? Okay. All right. And you got to do the torment, and you lose a finger. That's all part of picking a million. All right. So, but if you don't pick a finger, if you don't pick a million, you don't got to do the torment, right? Got it. Or if it doesn't round up to a million, then you don't. You just pick that number. All right. So this and week's, what, huh? So, sorry, another question. Uh, what constitutes rounding up to a million? Nine hundred nine nine. He's anticipating saying that. <laughs> he's anticipating saying that. Just to say under the million. That's why I see his well I see his brain. You smart asses. It's the scale. Because <laughs> right. right. I know you smart ass. But I think I'm under a million. Man. <laughs> Yeah, because I know you niggas would be like nine hundred ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. No, <laughs> it could be a dollar, it could be a um, hundred thousand, it could be yes, up to five hundred thousand. It depends on if you being an asshole in your answer. All right, it's to scale. So pretty much anything, anything, anything over five hundred thousand, yep. you round up to a million. There you go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> This week's torment is brought to you by Xandix Holdings. Come by and get your taxes done. All right, easy, quick plug. <laughs> 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 what did he what 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 say? There's, <laughs> there's only one location that's near you. It's near you. <laughs> <laughs> Go online, submit your paperwork, or come into the office. Only one location, so it's near you. Anyway. <clears throat> All right. So this week's torment is going to be... If you pick, if you decide to go with a million or it rounds up to a million, prison time ties you upside down, sticks his middle finger in your ass, then makes you suck it. What? And then you lose a finger. That's this week's torment. If you pick a million. A prison what? Prison time. That's his name. <laughs> <laughs> so you're tied upside, your butt naked tied upside down on an X. <laughs> And he takes his middle finger and shoves it in your ass, and then he makes you suck that middle finger. <laughs> How do you even come up with yeah. that? You have no like, idea. You never watched the show before. This is all it's day. All day. The, bad, the, 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 the bad thing, he tried to blame this shit on the Marine Corps. That, right. that, the Marine Corps didn't do no, that to you. No, that ain't Marine Corps. <laughs> it's I all in Dubai. I don't, I don't know what taxes you've been doing. <laughs> Okay, so number one, gentlemen. All right, here we go. How much would it take? 
and we're starting off easy. You know, I love to start off easy for you. Yeah. For you to run out butt naked in front of your family while dancing and singing I'm a Little Teapot five times. How much money would it take for you to do that? That's easy. I ain't. Nah. Rule number two. Yes, sir. You got to complete the task no matter what. <laughs> They you guess. see why we got rules? <laughs> you see? You <laughs> see? <Yeah. laughs> in the mind. <laughs> $1,000 and I'm doing the, the, the Drake helicopter dick. $1,000. dollars <laughs> <laughs> i am running out there swinging my dick like a helicopter like Petey Pablo. $1,000. <laughs> nice. $1,000. I'll say five. Five thousand. Five dollars? Five thousand. Five thousand. That's wow. You're some confident brothers, man. Y'all must be important or some shit. Y'all like fucking your whole family. Y'all just gonna run out there butt naked in front of them singing "I'm a little teapot" while you're dancing. And I keep a finger. Yeah. So yeah. <laughs> I'm a little teapot, but it's only gonna take five thousand. How much, Donnie? <laughs> <Which Bruh. laughs> hey, hey, I got a house full of girls, bro. Yeah, fucking finger. <laughs> North Carolina. <laughs> hey, nope. Hey, hey, hold Donnie, on, what, what you, you, what you doing, Donnie? He said he sounded like a million to him. I was like, you can add his hey, finger. Hey, Donnie gonna be in there. Donnie gonna be in there like. <laughs> no. Nope. Donnie's gonna call Ronnie. I'm gonna be like Ronnie. We need Touché. to. We, yeah, that's, why, that's the beautiful hey. thing about having an identical twin brother. I'll be like Ronnie. Hey, we I need, need to go do, do this stuff. I need <laughs> you to do this shit for me real quick. <laughs> Hey. You you gonna get your brother anally probed? <laughs> and no. you gonna take the loot? <laughs> we gonna make sure we gonna make sure we disappear and ain't nobody gonna ask. <laughs> uh oh! Wow! We got our first figures, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> We got a wow. first finger off. Wow. You, 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 down, you down a finger and you wow. got a finger in your butt. <laughs> you can't forget about that part. Yeah, because so you, you, you lose your finger, finger. <laughs> and, and prison tied and put a finger in your butt. <laughs> and you got to look it. <laughs> yeah, God. prison tied. Prison tied made you suck, suck his butt finger. <laughs> wow. All that to save your girls. Admirable there, Dad. Admirable. Outstanding. Hey, hey. As as a dad, you got two things you can do. You can show your kids how to be a honorable father <laughs> and husband. <laughs> That's it. That's it. That's hey, it. Hit the bar high. That's all I got to say. That's it. Hey, and then I, from now I, on, I, when you could talk to your girls, you just be like, "Yo, high four. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, I have a buy me gloves, Mr. McKay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, sleep. I know you remember. <laughs> Get them damn Marino isotopes. <laughs> with, the, with, the th- with the thumb just gone. <laughs> okay, number two. <laughs> How much would it take for you to lick the asshole of a road killed armadillo and swallow your saliva? <laughs> Let me finish. Though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, I'm trying. You, you and these, you and these adjectives. I, I try. I, I, I really try. But hey, you know that that whole filter thing you were talking about. You know, I don't got it either. So I, I can't. I, I can't control that shit sometimes. <laughs> Yeah, if it is, what did you gonna say? How much would it take for you to lick the asshole of a roll killed armadillo and swallow your saliva? Five dollars. That's nothing. I didn't ain't way worse than that shit overseas. Five dollars. A hundred thousand. Uh, I'm not holding hey, tongue. It, it'll Can't take, it'll take you five hours. <laughs> it, 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 it'll take you five hours to eat armadillo ass. <laughs> Bro, it's the best possession in San Antonio. Swallowing, I see the people swallowing them, uh, but uh, camel spiders. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
swallowing a camel spider and licking armadillo ass is two totally different things. Stop saying it like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I know. I mean, like if it was if you was like eating a cockroach or eating something like that, but no, you are licking an armadillo ass and you walk food. away. Road well, food. I did that before I eat a roach. <laughs> Guard! <laughs> nah. Sleep, you down and up? Wow! Hey, hey sleep, high four, high four! <laughs> <laughs> I'm good on that one. I'm, I'm good on that one. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. You are crazy, man. Mm -mm. Wait a minute. So what happened to Team Protect the Booty, though? Don't forget about Prince and Tom. Yeah. He just go, finger. He's going at least two knuckles deep. <laughs> just, a, just a finger. Hey, he said, he said two knuckles. One, two, nigga. One, two. That's it. That's still in your booty. Middle finger, though. You didn't say middle finger. All right. One, two. Prison time ties you upside down, sticks his middle finger in your ass to make either you way, suck it. Either, either way, I'm I'm not licking armadillo ass. <laughs> <laughs> That's not happening. It's not happening. <laughs> it's not happening. Woo. I'm not I'm not licking armadillo ass. It's not happening. Damn, we two fingers down. Alright, CJ, we got you coming up. You, you got to lose a finger sooner or later. You, got, you are hey, five perfect. up. <laughs> I'm a little surprised. The Jamaican in you is gonna let you let you eat armadillo ass? <laughs> I'm eating more ass. <laughs> That's a real problem. Mm. Armadillo. You see, no, you know, I, I get it now. You only you only have Jamaican because that Jamaican yeah. side went. Yeah. He was more Panamanian yeah. than That's the Panamanian side. <laughs> Alright, number three. How much would it take for you to sit in a pit of angry and hungry rattlesnakes for 11 minutes and 45 seconds? Shit, a hundred dollars, man. <laughs> I lived overseas for so long. Trust me, the type of stuff I've seen, man, that's nothing. Wow. 11 minutes, man, that's it. And, and I leave with a pair of boots. You crazy. <laughs> hey, good question. Never question. Could it be on my 65th birthday? Cause you oh, know what I want to happen after that. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want, I Bring want out of here. I want out of here. Thirty-two cents on my sixty-fifth birthday. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Bro, bro, Thirty-two cents. Wow. Belt. <laughs> hey. Wow. Mm -hmm. I, I'll let them niggas eat. I have a new motorcycle vest. Hey, we'll be good. Donnie, what did you get out as? Oh, you don't see the flag in the background? Nah. Bursting right. bomb. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Let's just ask him. All right, Cliff. CJ? Uh, I guess a thousand. A thousand dollars is all it would take for you to sit in a pit of angry or hungry rattlesnakes. I mean, I'm going to be dressed and shit. I'm going to be moving around. I ain't going to be just. Hey, will you have on your karate gi? <laughs> it's valid. That's valid. That's the that, question. That's, that's valid. valid. That's the weapon. They might be intimidated, dog, if that's they a, see that's that. That's a shit. weapon. I can use the belt to choke them out. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about where your neck at? Where your neck at? Right there. <laughs> You're gonna choke I'm gonna a choke snake out. out. God damn it! Wait for niggas to strike. Yo, next. Yo, that's some real hey. Chuck Norris shit right there. Yeah. That, that is beyond catching a bullet with your teeth. You're going to choke out a snake. A rattlesnake. <laughs> with your karate gi belt, nigga. That's right. <laughs> wow. Be with the gi. <laughs> he got that glow, damn it. He ain't playing with him. Hey, all he, right. still got all his, he still got all his fingers, too. He still got all his fingers. We, we you gonna lose one of them. Here we go. We, <laughs> here we go. All right. How much would it take, fellas, for you to allow a bigger, stronger man massage your naked meat with sand and lemon juice for an hour? <laughs> what? <laughs> There's a high pitch. <laughs> 
Yeah, take a finger. I don't need a bunch of amputees in the building. I don't need a pinky. I don't need a pinky swear no more anyway. <laughs> hey, let me let me get that again. What are we doing? Hell no. How much would it take uh, for you to allow a bigger, stronger man massage your naked meat with sand and lemon juice for an hour? Bro, you didn't even need to get through that sentence. As soon as it started, I was like, <laughs> "Naked meat is sand and like who was sitting there saying like, well, if it wasn't sand, I'm like, <laughs> it's not. but we actually have somebody who would. He's not here today. Hey, but, but if he like, was, he's like, well, you know, if it was, if it was low shit, no. <laughs> is the sand wet? Heavy <laughs> duty. Yeah, with, like, with lemon juice. juice. <laughs> it's wet with you lemon juice. About, you talking about exfoliating? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm starting to reconsider. Is it an avocado mask? <laughs> yeah, but you got to consider the alternative. God. <laughs> no, at this point, you already been there. It's like, eh. Well, lost one. Fuck it. <laughs> no, no, no. And I'm, now you up two million. <laughs> I'm. Mm. <laughs> uh, you already know what prison time uh, knuckles feel like. I mean, yeah. That see, that's what's that's what's making me consider. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna say for four hundred and seventy-two thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and let let he man <laughs> massage me. <laughs> you want me, Michael Clark Duncan? <laughs> no, Michael Clark Duncan, Duncan take you to Green Mile. <laughs> yeah, Kingpin. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and let the Undertaker massage me. Oh, he's he's taking those fingers inside of me. It's gonna be shaft ass, nigga. <laughs> yeah. Hey, my ace man. Come over here, let me see that meat. I'll be like, hey, Shaq. Go ahead and let's start that check. $472,000. Wow. my final answer. I'm going to go ahead and keep the digit. Okay. $472,000. What did you say, CJ? Donnie, what he got? I said, I'm taking a break. Donnie, Donnie went like this. <laughs> Donnie already down two. <laughs> you down two, too? I'm down one. I just my first one, remember? No, you I, down, I never said take a finger before. No, no. You said the man snake. No, 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 you I said, said you choked this thing. This, yeah. Remember, I still have fingers until this point. Bro, you said, yeah. my nigga right. ain't going to be nub at the end of this damn thing. <laughs> well, right now, it's just chop. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I, I can still ride my bike with it. <laughs> for real, you can still ride, nigga. <laughs> hey, hey, for real. All right, final one. All right, how much would it take for you to straddle and sit, allowing anal insertion of an extra large cucumber until it completely disappears into your anus? Bro, you sus. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't me, it's the questions, dog. No, no, no. I'm just How like, much hey. would it take for you to do it? Hey, I think I think I think Atlanta's starting to <laughs> starting to wear on you a little bit. Hey. I think that I think that Atlanta culture's starting hey. to wear on you a little bit. Hey, hey whatever <laughs> whatever <laughs> it takes for you to answer the question. Y'all yeah, say whatever you want, long you answer the question. They be like, man, I don't know why it's internet connection to stop that. <laughs> <laughs> like it's not me. I'm trying to speed test and everything. It just ain't working. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I don't know what happened. The, the mic's not working. Well, how much would it take for you to bully, booty, uh, booty swallow a, a cucumber? Was it cucumber? Yeah. You looking at the question like you ain't make that shit up. Right. Uh, what was it? No. <laughs> <laughs> I just looked down uh, to make sure it was what it was. Boy, 
Oh, y'all get real quiet. At the end of the day, <laughs> Sleep got the wee rocks. No, no. He got the horns. Cause I, cause I'm, I'm, da- I'm, I'm down two fingers. I'm not boofing a cuckoo. <laughs> it's not that. No. <laughs> Like, like, no, that's all I got. Hey, no I, I, I just feel like, bro. <laughs> bro. The worst part is he thought of these questions and asked himself how he would answer before this shit came on. Actually, no, I never do he that. never think so. He that's why said. I never answer. <laughs> <laughs> I say, what I do when I come up with these is, how much of these you, niggas going to squirm do? when they hear this? That's the question I ask. Because if I ask the question, what would I do? I'd never ask it. It'd never come up. I'd be like, no, nope, I ain't doing that. The would you rather is the worst. Yeah. See, that's why I never play. If I play, then I'm going to take it easy. If I don't play, then I got free reign to like completely gross y'all out. That's the point. Guard! <laughs> <laughs> take another finger. Guard! Wow. Y'all keep yeah. putting me in the cell with this nigga jail teeth. <laughs> Guard! <laughs> Okay, so so who has the most fingers left at this point? I got three. You got three. Wait, I got like one one finger left on one hand. I'm the two. I got yeah, two. No, I got. I got. I got three. I got three. Cause I said I'd do the last one for four hundred seventy-two thousand. He did. So I got three. I lost two. Wow. So we got a, a two-way tie. Outstanding. Good job, you fellas. Hey. I'm like, hey, this, this ain't the, this ain't the Super Bowl. There's no there's no rules to overtime. <laughs> <laughs> nah. yeah. Hey, we can end in a tie. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. There can be multiple winners. Outstanding. Hey. Well, that's gonna wrap up how much would it take? Even though this goes to would you rather? I'm still going to hit it with it. Outstanding, guys. I applaud you. Good job. Great sporting job. <laughs> this nigga keep trying to stick his fingers in my butt. Guard! Boy, hey, I'd be, I'd be in there snitching. No, nah, that, that's what I do. Yeah, you going you gonna to try to tie me upside down? You're going to have to deal with the guards. I'm snitching. <laughs> and the guards were like, hey, man, that's what you pick. Guards were in there with their phones like... Look at Big Sleep upside down again. Okay. Like, yeah. <laughs> this is just a temporary <laughs> visit. I'm 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 writing Too my congressman as soon as I get out of here. I'm getting this bitch shut down. <laughs> <laughs> Prison Tom gotta lose his fingers too after this. <laughs> I know mm-hmm. that's right. Two million dollars to throw it towards. Oh man, that was good. Yeah, so we're gonna get ready to get up out of here. I've been King Bear in the building. Comedian CJ Charles. Big sleep from the West Coast. And Donnie, current. <laughs> timeless, timeless and invincible. Awesome. <laughs> Perfect, brother. You could have did that shit yourself. <laughs> that was dope. And we're gonna see y'all on the next one. Y'all have a good one. Alright. Peace. Peace.